In the time and the place before recorded history, man and God coexisted. The most enlightened of men were allowed to traverse the astral plane to enter God's holy realm and seek out his advice. In time, the denizens of the underworld grew resentful of the presence of mortals in the astral plane. Defiantly, the grand demon Tazriel formed an evil weapon of ultimate destructive power. With this chaos axe, he rose up to challenge God himself. The ensuing battle between the two threatened to shred the fabric of very existence. Though he prevailed, God was brought to the brink of death. Unable to destroy the Chaos Axe, he hid it from Tazriel by casting the axe into the realm of humans. In order to prevent the demon from ever recovering his evil weapon, God forever shut off the astral plane to the world of men. Four seals were created and placed in the human realm. They could never be opened from the astral plane, nor would any being ever be able to pass between the two realities as long as even a single seal remained in place. However, these are only legends, tales half forgotten by most. The seals themselves have never been seen by any person alive, and most people would pay no mind to the tale. After all, the world has known that peace for thousands of years, that is, until he appeared. Galvis. There were those among him who believed that he was a demon, descended from Tazrael himself. But the thousands that he killed, who locked eyes with him in their final agonizing moments, knew that he was a man, and in, in, in that instant, lost all faith in humanity. The Dark Knight, he does look like the Dark Knight, he's like a little Batman looking over. This town deserves a better class of villain. <laughs> the Dark Knight ravaged the land and terrorized the populace like nothing else in recorded history. Any village that he visited faced certain annihilation. Oh, pretty blood! Most men had never heard the mournful wails of the women, for they had already been slaughtered like pigs, their entrails littering the ground like a pit of bloody vipers. Descriptive. Through sheer force and intimidation, he raised an army powerful enough to challenge that of the Imperial Camellia. Fueled by many successes, his lust for power exploded. Ten years ago, Galvis marched on Camellia Castle itself, determined to annihilate King Jeric and his Imperial Army to coronate himself supreme ruler of the planet. Hello everyone, I'm Brandon Dayton, your humble narrator, and this is Evil Quest! So we're gonna kill some folk and uh, just, just be generally not very nice. So enjoy this title screen. I think that's all of us marching around. Yeah. Looking good. Looking good, boys. Tarkan! King Jack's lackeys will be approaching from the two directions, east and north. Take half the men and head north. It's up to you to keep us from being surrounded. As you command, master. <clears throat> Get moving. I can see them approaching from this direction. The northern battalion will not be far behind. What are you incompetent fools waiting for? Follow me! That's that's not half. That's really not half. Let's go, you cretins that can't do math! Weird. Uh, get him. Get him. Oh, that guy's getting double team. Now we're talking double team! Supreme! Oh, yeah. Victory is assured. All right, soldiers, from here we head east. But, General, the Chameleon Army will be approaching from the west. We should stand our ground here and protect the flank. To hell with Galvis! I'm in charge now, and why say we head east? Think about how he treats us. Things will be much easier with me as your supreme commander. Well, he did murder my wife and children. Of course he did. He's an abomination that we should allow the Chameleons to rid us of. Come on, I know of a nearby village where we can really have some fun. Death to Galvis! DEATH TO THE BASTARD! That's the spirit! Let's go then! So I've been betrayed. That dog. Pathetic! This is a disaster! Now we have to rely on Tarkan to... By order of King Jeric the Benevolent, you are hereby arrested for crimes against humanity. Will you come peacefully? Tarkan! He failed! 
But how did so many of you remain alive? He would have killed at least most of your men. We didn't see anyone on our way here. Now I ask you again, villain. Will you come peacefully? <sighs> Tarkan. He betrayed you, my lord. Tell your king I'll see him in hell! Shada da 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 da! Oh wow. Can't take on 15 guys. But he did his damnedest! With the betrayal of General Tarkin, Galvis' army was rooted, beaten, and humiliated. The evil knight was finally captured. As a false show of benevolence, the King of Camellia declared that Galvis was insane and should be spared from execution. He was sentenced to life in prison. Shortly after his imprisonment, Galvis discovered a kindred spirit, an old thief who hated the world as much as he did. Galvis, I know you want to destroy the world, but you can't do it through brute force alone. You need a better plan. I'm listening, but make it quick, old man. I tire of your senseless banner. Years ago, I was looting a pyramid in the southern desert. I snuck past the sleeping Medusa and entered a room. It was one of the seals. You actually saw the seals? Then the legend must be true. If I can open the seals and unleash the power of the Chaos Axe... Yes, what's... With that axe, not even God himself could stop you. Your path of destruction would reach from here across the entire astral plane. Then I will have vengeance against all who wrong me. King Jarek, Tarkin, even God! They all will die, and I will crush this miserable world. Yes, let us see it burn. Good morning, Captain. Did you hear that the rookie is scheduled to feed Galvis today? Yes, Elric. Poor guy. It's his first time, too. Do you know the bastard slaughtered his family? He was just a, ta a child at the time and saw the entire thing. Yes? Oh, here it comes. We shouldn't say anything else. <laughs> oh, hi, buddy. Hey, Elric. How you doing today? I'm fine, sir. That's good to hear, Elric. Well, I guess you've heard by now. Heard what, sir? Well, you're scheduled to feed him today. Him? Yes, him. Galvis. The one they call the bastard. The guy who slaughtered your family. Franklin, get the hell out of here if you can't control yourself. Sorry, Captain. Sorry, Elric. <laughs> <clears throat> okay, Elric. You heard the idiot. Get going. And whatever you do, don't talk to the prisoner. No matter what he says to you. Ignore it. Yes, Captain. Off he goes. Doing his duty. This is what I've been waiting for! I can finally take my revenge on that bastard! I don't know why he's Australian. Here we go! Prisoner, I'm here to deliver your daily meal. Come closer, you little stain. You look very familiar. Did I kill someone close to you? I, uh... Yeah, I remember your face now. You were just a child at the time. Oh, your tears made me laugh. Look at you now! Such a big man! Did you come here to kill me? You're totally unarmed and there's no one here to stop me. Everyone will call me a hero. Well, Elric, step in here and do it if you can stand the smell. I'm sick of wasting away in this rat-infested hellhole. Come on, hero! Do it! You asked for it, you bastard! Yunk. Where'd you get that? It's a shank, you intrepid fool. I've been carving it for years and now it's finally tasted blood. Tell me, Elric, is this how you saw re your revenge playing out today? You... You know, Elric, I'm feeling generous today. If you tell me where my things are, I'll go ahead and put you out of your misery. Otherwise, you could slowly bleed out here. In agony! What things? The charge orb, the dark axe, the dark axe, and my iron armor. Where are they? The charge orb upstairs in a room calling with rats. I heard the dark armor fell into the sewer. Your iron armor is a trophy. We, we keep it in the mess hall. Interesting, Elric. Thank you for coming here to kill me today. I knew I kept you alive for a reason. However, I've changed my mind. I'm going to leave you to suffer. But don't worry, the rats are hungry, and they will eagerly keep you company in your final hours. Welcome to Evil Quest. Press the enter key or left mouse button to attack. This is a save point. I click. I click. I click. I click. Okay. I guess I saved. Wonderful! Oh, that rat almost got me. Hi, Poochie! Oh no! Get the Poochie! Woo! 
Nothing in here. I wonder if people see me, like, are they gonna freak out? Or can I just stab them? I ain't seen no people so far, just bats. Stop taking damage! We're not gonna make it very far if you keep taking damage! There's a gate. Fart! Flee, flee, flee! Oh look, it's my friend. Certainly he'll have something helpful to say. Oops. Not that. Not that. Not that. The enter key for everything is kind of weird, but okay. Galvis, my boy, you're free, just like we planned! Yes, and now we can get out of here, together! Uh, yes, yes, at last! But first, now that I can see your hands, teach me the hype spell you've always spoken so highly of. I know you're too weak to actually make use of it, but, but if you show me how, it'll make our escape all the easier. Of course, my boy, it's just like this! You learned the spell, Ice Wad. At last! Now there's just one last thing! What's that, son? Tell me what is it that troubles you? Oh, nothing. It's just... Blah. Why? It's simple, you ancient buffoon. Your snoring and horrendous smell have kept me awake countless nights. I can't bear the thought of spending any more time near you. Galvis, proud of you. <laughs> Goodbye. Alright. Rice, rice mouse button to cast a spell? Z or rice mouse button? I hope you're gonna deal with my bumbling speech. I can't seem to make words today. Oh, we went that way already. I wanna go up, 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 up. Ow! Oh, middle mouse button. Yeah. Boop! Level up! Strength and, uh,. Vitality, I believe, yeah. Continue! Oh. More gold, more gold! Can I poke that? This isn't a very well-maintained castle! The inspector would have a field day! Do you understand me? A field day! Poke. 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 Yay! You obtained the charge orb! Hold down the enter key, I left mouse button to charge. Alright. Are we charging? Are we charging yet? There we go. Kamehameha! Yeah, that's pretty evil. Dragon Ball Z. Make me watch like 15 minutes of show for 5 minutes of fun! Kameha! Alright. Where's the floor one? Here we go. This is where I'll find my super axe, and I can get rid of this dinky little shank. Dinky, dinky, dinky! What are you doing? I have the finest gems underground! Guaranteed rat feces free! That's how you know it's not rat feces free. Leave me alone! I want none of your disgusting poop. Uh-oh. You must be the one that found my axe! It doesn't like you're gonna just hand over that key! So prepare to be annihilated! Annihilation! Uh oh. Not doing hot, okay. It's not really complicated or anything. You just have to face the right way. What am I doing? Give him a poke! Give him a poke! Give him a poke! And a poke! And a poke! Oh, no! Shit! You're gonna run out of herbs, Galvis! No! Get him! Get him! Oh, thank God! A little more strength, please, and some toughness. Woo! That was close. Had to spam some herbs there. 
You obtained the Dark Axe! Uh... And I want that one. Yeah, he doesn't really know how to swing an axe, but that's okay. Just kind of shove it in front of you. That's how it works. Uh, I was going to actually kill you and take your stuff, but... I'm not evil enough to kill a merchant, apparently. Oh, no! 50 damage, holy crap. All right! Now we can probably hit that secret key switch. Yeah, kill the dogs with one. Okay. Get the money, get the money! Oh, I went the wrong way? Guess so. Well fart. No! Stupid rat! Bunk. Bunk. Where is it? I saw it moments ago. Bunk. Bunk. Yes. Yeah! Uh-oh. Got you now, Trick. Gotta remember to use my ice spells and shit. Mm -hmm. What's over here? Little chest for me. Antidote. Well, that's just fine. Yeah! Froze you up, huh? Didn't even see it coming. Doot doot. Hi, Bob. I kill a lot of dogs in video games. Oh, yeah! Can't touch this. Let us save here! Are we saving? I think we saved. <laughs> I think. Whoa, bro. Be careful with that pointy stick. Put somebody's eye out. Do, do, do. Better find my armor before I go any further. Okay. Mm then I suppose we shall. Oh, he got me. Got no herbs. Here we go. Prison mess hall. Ah, the bastards escaped! Franklin go summon General Boosh! We'll try to slow him down here! But Captain, I'm the one that needs to kill him! You don't know what he said about my- That's enough, you idiot! Get going! Yes, Captain. You're lucky this time, bastard. Oh yeah. Oh yeah. Who wants to do it? Who wants to do it? Uh, like that, huh? I'm the evilest! The evilest, I say! Shield ring. 150 gold. <clears throat> Iron armor. So we gotta get iron armors and the shield ring. Huzzah! We're awesome again! Don't hurt me. Yes, I need lives. And I need saves. Okay. Thanks for that. I want to get out of the prison! Oh, zero damage. Awesome. I am the evilest. Ha 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 ha. Oh. You will also look equally evil. Galvis, so good of you to finally escape. Now I can finally kill you without the royal court's misguided interference. Imbecile, 
Your hawkish demeanor does not impress me. Once I escape this prison, I'm gonna find and slaughter your family. What do you think about that? That's never gonna happen. I'm gonna rid this world of your unholy presence once and for all. Shut your face, simpleton! My axe thirsts for blood, and your fat neck looks ripe for the taking. That's right. Uh-oh. 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 General Boosh, he's tougher than I thought. Boosh! Oh. Well, it looks like General Boosh has defeated us for now. But we shall be back next time for a little more evil quest. I hope you'll join me. I've been Brandon Dayton. Until then.